transforming quadratic equation into standard form. Example number 1, x square plus 4x is equal to negative 10. Solution. 3x square plus 4x is equal to negative 10, since our target is to transform the equation into standard form, which is ax square plus bx plus c is equal to 0, as you can see negative 10 is not in its proper location, therefore, we need to transpose negative 10 to the other side. So we have 3x square plus 4x is equal to negative 10. In transposing we will use the addition property of equality wherein we will add the inverse of negative 10 which is positive 10. Plus 10. Plus 10. We have 3x square plus 4x plus 10, though we will add negative 10 and positive 10 the result will be equal to 0, that is now the standard form of the equation 3x square plus 4x is equal to negative 10. The standard form is 3x square plus 4x plus 10 is equal to 0, now we will identify now the value of a, b, and c. The value of a is equal to 3. The value of b is equal to 4. The value of c is equal to 10. This how we transform the equation 3x square plus 4x is equal to negative 10 into standard form, and also identifying he value of a, b, and c. Example number 2. The equation is 2x square plus 5 minus 3x is equal to 0. Solution. Write again the given equation, 2x square plus 5 minus 3x equals 0. Our target is to transform the equation in standard form. The standard form is, ax square plus bx plus c is equal to 0. In the given equation, it is just simply changing the location of negative 3x and positive 5. Reminder in changing or arranging, there no changing of sign. So, we have, 2x square minus 3x plus 5 is equal to 0. Which is the standard form of the given equation. Then, we will now identify the value of a, b, and c. So the value of a, is equal to 2, the value of b, is equal to negative 3 and the value of c is, equal to 5. That is how you transform the given equation, and also identifying the value of a, b, and c. Example number 3. The given equation is 2x open and close parenthesis x plus 2 is equal to 9. Or, we can also read as, 2x multiplied by x plus 2, is equal to 9. Solution. Write again the equation, 2x multiply by x plus 2, is equal to 9. As you can see the equation involves parenthesis which is more complicated for you. So, that is next step. Remove the parenthesis by using the distributive property. By distributive property, we will multiply 2x inside the parenthesis. Let's start with, 2x multiply 2x, the result is, 2x square. Next, 2x multiply to 2 the product is, 4x. So, we have, 2x square plus 4x is equal to 9. Next step, we need to transpose 9 to the other side of the equation to form its standard form. So, we will use the addition property of equality, by adding the inverse of positive 9. The inverse of positive 9 is, negative 9. Therefore, we will add both sides of the equation by negative 9. Negative 9, and negative 9. So, we have 2x square plus 4x plus negative 9. 9 minus 9 is equal to 0. Or simply the standard form of the given equation is, 2x square plus 4x minus 9 is equal to 0. Now, we will now identifying the value of a, b, and c. So, the value of a is, 2. The value of b is, 4 and the value of c is, negative 9. That is how you transform the given equation, and also identifying the value of a, b, and c. Example number 4. The given equation is 3x multiply by x plus 1 minus 2, is equal to 0. Solution. 
First we write again the given equation which is, 3x multiply by x plus 1 minus 2, is equal to 0. As you can see the given equation contain the parenthesis, which makes the equation complicated. What will you do now is remove the parenthesis using the distributive property. We will multiply 3x inside the parenthesis, so, may we start with 3x multiply 2x, the product is, 3x square. Next, we will multiply 3x to positive 1 so the answer is, positive 3x, minus 2, is equal to 0. So we have, 3x square plus 3x minus 2 is equal to 0, which is the standard form of the given equation. Since it's already in its standard form, we will now identifying the value of a, b, and c. The value of a is, 3. The value of b is, 3 and value of c is, negative 2. That is how you transform the given equation, and also identifying the value of a, b, and c. Example number 5. The equation is, 2x multiply by x plus 4 plus 4 is equal to 2. Solution. First, we will write again the given equation which is, 2x multiply by x plus 4 plus 4 is equal to 2. Our next step is, removing the parenthesis by applying the distributive property. We will multiply the 2x inside the parenthesis. So, we start with, 2x times x the answer is 2x square. Next, we multiply 2x into positive 4. So, the product is positive 8x. Then plus 4, is equal to 2. Now, as you can see the positive 2 is not in its proper location. So we need to transpose it to the other side of the equation by applying the addition property of equality. What will we do now is, we will add both sides of the equation by the inverse of positive 2. The inverse of positive 2 is negative 2. So, we add negative 2 and negative 2. Now, we have 2x square plus 8x plus positive 2. Then, 2 minus 2 the result is 0. Therefore, the standard form of the given equation is 2x square plus 8x plus 2 is equal to 0. Since the equation is in standard form, we are ready now in identifying the value of a, b, and c. The value of a is, 2. The value of b is, 8 and the value of c is, equal to 2. That is how you transform the given equation, and also identifying the value of a, b, and c.